What's up guys? In this video tutorial, or Photoshop tutorial I should say, I'll be showing you guys how to make a cool gradient for your, or any purpose um, at all to to make a cool gradient for uh, either thumbnails or pictures or anything you would like to use it for. Um, so in this, uh, to get started, <laughs> you want to go to file and click uh, new or command N to bring up this window. And then um, all you got to do is put the width to 1280 by 720 um, and then resolution 100 and just keep everything uh, at default just change the width and height and just press OK and then once you're here um, you want to go down to this uh, gradient tool as you can see right here it says gradient tool you can just also press G to, uh, to get the tool so if I was here I can just press G and it will take me there automatically um, so it looks like this and select it now once you've selected it make sure that um, depending on what kind of gradient you want um, this gradient, I'll, sh I'll be showing you guys how to use the radi radial uh, gradient. So you just click the second one here, and it looks like a circle. And then you go in the middle. Now, if you want to be more precise um, where you uh, where you put it, press Command-R for the Mac or Control-R on the Windows. And all you got to do is on the top um, ruler right here, you want to click and drag. And then it should automatically snap in the middle like that. And then it's going to be blue, by the way. And then do the same thing um, on to the left side. Just it should automatically slide like that. Now, once you've done that, you can also just um, move your cursor there and just click. You have to click and drag to the to a corner like this. It can be any corner, but I just go to the right, so just like that. You can go like this, but it doesn't matter. Now, once you're here, it should be almost perfectly aligned. Now, to clear it, you can either um, on the ruler make sure you have the uh, move tool selected. You have to move it like this. You can move it this way, or you can go to window or view and clear guides and that will uh, remove the guides so um, now to do this um, cool effect let me just open up my layers panel here um, it will be selected all you gotta do is click this uh, the curves or I believe that's what it's called the curves right yeah or adjustment layer now what we want to do is you want to select the gradient once you select the gradient um, you want to select the style at radial and this will be uh, it will match up as the one we chose before and um, once you've done this, you want to click on the gradient. Just click right there, and then select one of these. Because if it's transparent, it's not gonna, it's not gonna be, it's not gonna be a solid color. So you want to select the first, uh, this one, or it can be any in your case. But I might be changing my colors. Click this uh, square, and then click color. Now here you can select a uh, color. Make sure that the color you select on your first one, right here, is um, your lighter color. So I'm gonna select, um, I'm gonna select. Uh, blue so you can just use it like this in case you haven't uh, used Photoshop in a while just click that and press OK and then on the other square you want to do the same just click color and then make sure this one is darker so in this case I'll be using black and then press OK and then press OK again now once you're here you want to scale it up a bit not too much so if you go too far it's gonna kinda go off and you don't want that so just kinda close about 130 would be perfect Whoops! Oh, I did something wrong. Okay. Uh, in case you did that, just double click the adjustment layer right there. Now, once you're here, you want to um, angle it just like this. Um, you can angle it wh uh, whichever uh, way you want. Um, it's not really hard. You can just um, it, it makes it bigger uh, the angle. So uh, I'm gonna just select it around. Let's see. I think that would be perfect. So negative thirty. So negative 30 would be perfect. Just press enter, and then you'll have your uh, radial right here. And that's you can just type whatever you want. In this case, I'll be using. Um, you can use any. In this case, I'll be using Madrid Pro. Select, and I'm gonna just put uh, gradient. I'm pretty sure that's how you spell gradient. <laughs> and then all you gotta do is change the color. You just click right there. Uh, the text color. I'm gonna go with white. Press OK, um, and then that way you now can. Um, add whatever you guys want to this uh, which is pretty cool um, in my case you can also change your layer style uh, but this is for text I already made a video on this um, if you check out my videos but this is how to make a cool uh, gradient on your videos or not videos but just a simple gradient so go ahead and leave a like comment below guys I'll see you guys later peace